fusion uh, advantages uh, as I said um, fast execu execution short selection um, we clear uh, fusion through a uh, great clearing frame with which there is not a lot of shorts that uh, you can get you saw today we showed it, uh, it was possible to short like Facebook in the morning a lot of platform don't have it I didn't have uh, R2 borrow uh, problems basically since I start trading uh, with Fusion um, scanners there are scanners inside uh, the platform um, yes a switch slide you don't see the advantages slide Does everyone see the advantages slide? Yeah, okay. Run, maybe it's uh, your problem. Um, okay, so short, sele short selection, sorry. We have scanners inside uh, the platform that are really easy to use. Hot keys, I will show you. Very easy hot keys. Um, we have a very, very good uh, route selection. A lot of routes for you to use. That's a big advantage. There are some uh, almost free routes for removing liquidity. Um, get rebates, whatever uh, you can get, it's on there. Um, there are enter and cover strategies, I will show you what it means. Um, we place orders with a button, you don't have to cancel and then replace the order. You can do it in a switch of a button, uh, just on the platform, which is uh, really easy, um, basically, to use. Um, one big advantage is that beginners can start with free account. Not also beginners, but for beginners, this is a, a really a good thing uh, for beginners to start with a free account, a platform free account that uh, will give them a lot of room to be profitable uh, traders. You have alerts and basket trading. Disadvantages. Okay, if you don't see the the slide that I'm talking about, just that someone will tell me that uh, it's free or something. Okay. Um, on most routes, you can only take 100 lots. That means you can't trade 150, 220, 10, 20, 30 shares. Um, you can shares. You can trade with 100 shares, 200, 300, etc. Our servers are closed overnight and weekends. It means the platform is basically can be used from like 7 or 8 a.m. I think 7 a.m. to um, like 8, 9 p.m. not include weekends so you can't really practice on that on the weekends and uh, as I said it can be complicated to handle for some users for those of you who don't have problem with uh, computers or trading platforms uh, it will be easy to use but if you do struggle with uh, platforms from uh, time to time then uh, um, it can be a little complicated to handle for a couple of the guys. Um, okay, features that we will go uh, over uh, today. Okay, um, okay. הכוונה היא שהתוכנה יש בה המון 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 אפשרויות, המון המון פיצ'רים. היא לא פשוטה כמו הדס, היא תוכנה שהיא מאוד מאוד פשוטה להתנהל בה. מי שיש לו בעיה עם קצת יותר מחשבים וזה יוכל להיות לו קצת יותר מסובכת, אבל שוב פעם, אנחנו עושים שיעור לכל מי שפותח חשבון, one on one, עד שתשלוט בה לחלוטין, אז uh, ככה שאני לא רואה בזה בעיה. What I also said is that in Hebrew that uh, we do a one on one lessons for everyone who's uh, open an account, we set you up on the account, so this is not really a problem, but if you're afraid uh, let's say uh, yeah, from computers or platforms then just stay with DAS we have DAS we did a webinar on DAS that was in Hebrew so if you guys uh, if you guys will want a webinar on DAS in English I can do it uh, sometimes uh, in the coming weeks okay Fusion DMA let's uh, see what uh, features we will uh, go through today uh, we'll go over uh, settings Level 2, charts, the bladder, scanners, leads, art keys, and trading example. And at the end, we will get back to the slide to see uh, pricing for uh, Fusion DMA. Okay, so let me just bring up, bring up the, the platform. Tell me that you see, that is clear to everyone. And we'll start from here. 
Okay, everyone can see platform. Is that too big, too small? Okay, great. Um, I will start from uh, settings. In just a second. I'll take this one out for now and this one and we'll start from this window. This is the Fusion uh, main window. This is the window when you connect after you will uh, after it will be basically on your uh, desktop screen and you click twice on Fusion DMA. This is uh, where you will be able to connect. You will enter your uh, username, this is a demo username, and uh, a password. Uh, I do trade live on uh, on uh, Fusion Run also for the last, uh, as I said, three to four weeks since, since the end of September uh, we trade on uh, Fusion. Um, also in this window you will be open to, you will be able to open all uh, windows. You can see all windows are here. Uh, you can also open windows from here. Just uh, put in uh, this one, as you can see, open windows and you have all the windows the same as you have in here, okay, and style, uh, now you can see it's uh, carbon, but basically you can uh, change the the same color for fusion, for example, now it's use a uh, blue style, just put carbon, I like it better that way, it looks way better um, like this. Okay, so we will uh, jump into settings now. On settings we have uh, all those windows. Okay, if I just click on one of them, I will get uh, this window. This is the uh, settings window. As you can see, I will try to make it bigger a little bit. No, I can't. But okay, we have a uh, first tab is the connection. You can go by every tab over here or just go through the tabs in here uh, on the top. Uh, basket is for uh, basket orders, um, check spread for example, you can uh, put it, everything here is a true and false to activate the features or not, you can basically I can put it on true and change the spread limit and uh, what it will do, it will uh, reject all, uh, all uh, orders on uh, stacks with let's say a spread if I put like 5 cents, so every stack that have uh, more than 5 cents spread, it will just uh, reject uh, every order that I will uh, throw uh, to the market. Um, this is uh, the basket. I don't really use basket orders, so I'll not go over this uh, uh, too much. Um, this is colors. You can change every colors that you want on everything here. Um, this is like level 2, price levels. As you can see, I will show you the level 2, you will see that this is the level, the colors of the level 2 that I put, this is customized uh, to what I did. Um, defaults, defaults has uh, some interesting uh, features uh, to watch, like the lot, the lot size is basically what will be the default size that you will get after you'll put um, any uh, any symbol in the level 2 window, you can change it to 500, 100, 200, whatever, and uh, every time I will do that, I will change that, it will be changed in the level 2 order. Uh, increment values, size or price, it means uh, they are like the arrows near the shares and the price uh, uh, we, near the price box in the level 2, I will show you that quick. Okay, so if we have the level 2, those are these uh, buttons, this is big and this is small. So, when I go to default now, and I will bring this up, so if I change small or big, that will, uh, that will determine how much the, the buttons change the price or the size. I do it from the add keys, so I don't really use those, but uh, you can change everything. Here, uh, duration is the Time in force, day, go till cancel, uh, whatever venue selection are the routes, um, the customable routes that you want to uh, show in the window. And uh, we'll talk about order strategy and cafe strategy uh, in a minute. Um, in the preferences, you got a keep loss size in order box. We'll show you what an order box is. So basically, if 
that I can change it to a true and that will keep always the lot size in the order box. I use, use it on false because basically what I want is to um, when the order box is open and I'll show you what an order box is is just to show whatever I want whatever size that I want to put and uh, will not go back to this 100 for now that this is the lot size um, automatically okay so I put it on false order strategy and uh, cover strategy you have for listed and for NASDAQ I mean this is for listed NYSE um, stocks and for NASDAQ stocks uh, basically what it means it's what will be the default on uh, what will be uh, the default in here in the in the uh, level 2 when you press an order strategy or a cover strategy a cover strategy we will see later when we will do a test trade that if you right click on a symbol that you're already in you can click and cover like 50% cover 75% so you just decide um, on what on what route it will go and on what uh, kind of uh, order it will go okay so um, basically as you can see this is on Arca market so everything that I'm doing is uh, throwing into Arca market if I do automatically through the right click I will show you that um, later when we'll do some kind of uh, a test trade layout it's where you basically to save uh, your layout you can ask to save your layout at the exit um, this is untrue you should do that highlight windows if you want every window that you look at to be highlighted with a frame um, all over it I don't use it because it's not really um, it's 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 setting the windows uglier let's uh, let's let's call it that way so uh, I'm not really using it I'm just saving you the layout and that's it that's what I do with this tab uh, market is a really important one um, there are a couple of uh, features here on the preferences that uh, you need uh, to know how to use um, enable click entry this is this window if you wanted to stay uh, all the time on the level 2 okay so you just um, put you here and that will show everything here all the time show open orders it will show you uh, your open orders here on the level 2 when we'll do an order later you will see there is a line over here that will show you the open orders um, that's basically it box follow mm price I mean when the box is open it will follow the price on the prints and it will change uh, automatically what else do we need to know trader keys okay we'll get to odd keys a little bit uh, later those two tabs basically are uh, tabs for uh, trader keys this is for uh, trader keys are uh, customizable um, trading keys it means that you can do whatever you like new keys on the keyboard you have a couple of uh, of selections here and uh, you can this is a uh, predefined keys and you just need to assign a key in your keyboard to everything and just uh, and it will uh, do it uh, already okay on the trading also some preferences that uh, you need uh, to look at I don't really use E on the trading uh, too much because um, I don't use them that much on to change it or uh, do those kind of uh, things okay so that was the settings we'll go uh, into the hotkeys uh, later before I do uh, the test trade okay so uh, let's start from a uh, chart window this is uh, basically a chart on Fusion as you can see it's uh, charts are very nice and very easy to handle and to use uh, you change the time frame over here, change very quickly no walls everything this is like my daily a regular chart so the movie in average uh, ages are simple um, if I want to change that 
I go to here, if I want to remove them, I do remove all, or just the simple moving averages, line studies, so I have all the line studies, Fibonacci are here, and um, Fibonacci are here and everything you need to know. How did I uh, open the charts? From this window, the main window, let me just take this one out, and also the indices, okay. Everything you need to open a window, you go to this. Okay, here you have windows and you have charts. Okay, and I will, I will click on charts and new charts will come up. And uh, basically, if I have these charts, I can just save it as default. I click save on default. And on the new chart that I just brought up, I just click load from default and I have the same chart. I just, I just will enter a symbol here and I'll have a chart with what I save as default. This is um, you can see spy chart now, 15 minutes with uh, exponential moving averages. What else do we have here? Uh, market time, so now it's standard, it means no pre or post market. You can add pre or post market, bar style, you can have line chart, whatever, candlesticks, indicators we talked about. Um, there is an option called show 3D candles. This is how the candles will look in 3D. I don't use it. I don't like it. Show a X grid on Y grid. Then you have these lines here. I just take them down. If you don't want the volume, you take out the volume. Um, horizontal separators are those lines of the daily. Um, display info is this one above the barrier. Day separators I have. Real time label is this label here, and uh, at the bottom of this one, if I right click, there is settings. Uh, you don't see it. I'll try to take it higher. I'll click it here. Okay, now you see uh, chart settings. Okay, so when I go into chart settings, here I can change all the colors of the bars up, down, background, whatever I want to use. Um, I change everything in here. Okay, again, right click, chart settings, and I get this window. Also on the chart, um, what we have, when we go over, you see this box here on the left, so I can just take the box, put it in here, I can put it whenever I want on the chart. If I don't want the box, I just, and just I need a small box just to see the price. I go on the right side of the chart, as you can see, and there's just a small box with the price here. So. This is uh, really nice and uh, easy to use. Zoom, if I want to zoom, I just click on zoom and uh, I get in as I want. I move right and left to take the charts um, to the sides. Um, okay, so I minus here again. Link. All the windows can be linked uh, in the platform, just as you know, this is like uh, eSignal. You can uh, choose the color, like for uh, green, and uh, this one is green as well, as you can see. So when I change symbol here, it will change on other, other platforms, <laughs> sorry, on other windows as well. Uh, everything is linked uh, together. Let me just close one leave this one on. Um, what else do we need to know about charts? That's basically everything you need to know about uh, charts. They're really easy to use, really comfortable. If you want to draw, you get over in. And with this and study trend line and you just draw. Okay, that's it. Auto link chart with level 2. As I said, if there is a level 2, there is a link over here. You just put the same colors on everything. If I'll put it on red and the level 2 on green, so if I'll change the symbol now, it will not change. Okay, if I'll change it to green here also, then you will put Apple now, it will change on the chart as well. Okay, Jacob? Drawing on the chart. Um, you go here into line study, trend line, and you have this pencil now, and you just draw in whatever you like. Remove, so you just delete it. 
and that's it, it's gone. Okay, um, what else? This is charts, really easy to use, really friendly. After you do all changes, um, just you do um, save as default and then you load on every other chart. There is uh, also one option that I didn't show you, it's uh, volume up down colors. To see if I, sh if I uh, show volume up down colors, it just bring them in red and green um, as you like. I just use it like that, I don't need the volume to be on uh, red or green. Okay, let's now go to the lists. Okay, so lists here are also very easy to use. Um, this window in lists, as so you can see now, it's a long list, for example. Um, I did a out key that, that says Control N is like a, um, is select all, Control V will delete all. Um, if you want to change, okay, if you want to change um, to change the columns, you just go to settings and select columns. And you, I just have symbol out to bow. This is where I see if the sh if the stock is shortable or not. A is for uh, available. Um, okay, so um, an H is uh, out of borrow, so I just use this, the last, the change, and the change from the open, that's it. I don't use anything else on the list. What I do uh, in the morning, that's nice, I just put a couple of names here. I, g I just, I will put some names in here. This is what I do every morning. I get all my gap list, I put it in here. And then uh, what I'll do to separate them, I'll just put a dot, okay? And then let's decide that Facebook is a uh, tier one. I'll take this one and drag, drag and drop it to here. I'll put uh, two dots, okay? I'll put it here in the middle. And I'll take Apple down because it's a tier three. And then, so these are tier ones, tier two, tier three. So basically you can drag and drop it and that's it, that's how you handle it. It's very easy and every, very friendly to use. Also, what we talked about on the cover and ad strategy. Uh, if you remember, this is what I was talking about. You can come here to a stock and just click it and if you are in, what you can basically do is you can uh, decide delete it or add it or select all. It's to cover, let's say you are in and you want to cover 50%, so you cover 50% or you just add 50% or buy to basket, uh, save the stock list, um, etc. Uh, always on top, it means that this window will stay always in, on top of everything on your screen. By the way, on Fusion, all windows are not uh, are independent, they are not connected to the... basically they are not connected to the platform itself, like on DAS, for example, that you have to get them out or in other platforms. All windows are independent, you can take them to everywhere on your uh, desktop, on all screens. So that was uh, lists. Okay, I have uh, this one, this one calls the bladder. Here you can basically see everything, you can see orders, um, every order that you will have. This is the P&L bar, you don't have uh, to use this one, the P&L bar. Basically, you don't need to look at PNL or during trading. You just take it out. I just put it now in to um, just show you show PNL bar. Um, okay, so I have your all execution. Use the couple of test trade that I did on EAT earlier. Okay, cancels. If I have something cancel, you will see here all the cancels. Position, close position, closed PNL. How much shares I traded. Etc. Locates if you have uh, something that you will locate. It means if you will ask for something that is out to borrow, and uh, they will give you shares to trade, it will uh, show in here. And uh, the blotter in the in here will show you everything that you did, all the tickets, where did it go, on which uh, route, uh, what time, etc. Um, so basically, I have these two windows. When I trade, I will show you the screen later, full. I have one on position, one on orders. Just stay there with the level two, and I trade so I can see all my orders and all my position um, open uh, when I need to. Okay, 
Also, if I have something here, right click, now it's in gray because I don't have any position open, but you can cover 50 or add 50. Um, I have flat and all, or just flatten. Okay, so if I'm in panic and just want to get out, I just do flatten. Um, and something uh, nice that we will see, um, uh, it's order update, okay, I can order the, I can update the order if I have a stop order, I don't need to do a new one, I will just change the price or change the size after I take partial or whatever, um, I can update it to a market order and then it will just go or whatever, cancel everything so I can do everything from my right click on position that uh, I'm already in. Um, okay, so we did charts, um, we did the bladder, that is nice, and now we'll go to and lists, and we'll go to um, level 2, which basically is the most interesting uh, windows, as always, in all platform. Okay, so this is the level 2, this is show a click entry, okay, uh, by right click it, you can add it or uh, let it go, remember, on my preferences, on the default, on the settings, I uh, I put that I want this to be in all the time. Okay, so this is uh, showing all the time. I basically, I will show you later, I'm using ad keys. This is buy stop market ad key, short. This is limits orders. Um, and one click here and uh, it goes back to the click entry. So this is also always on market order. Okay, so when I just need to get out or to get in really quick, I use the I use the buttons to buy or to sell or to short, but I don't really use it. I use uh, hotkeys that we'll talk about in a few uh, minutes. I have the prints inside uh, the time and sale, basically inside the level two. This is the colors that I put. Um, also, you can see the air near the name of the of the stock it show you if it's available for short or not okay um, this is low of the day high of the day I will show you how to um, change it right click change level one fields and you can put whatever you want to be in here you can decide how many items will be in a row it means I choose I chose three or so it will be high low volume uh, whatever I uh, put in right click uh, in here, um, change background, um, settings, this is the most interesting part. I can, sh um, what do we need here? This one, the order box position, if it will go on the bottom, on the top, on the bar. It means when I press the hotkeys and the order box opens, remember the order box from the settings. So when the order box open, where it will show? Above the, this window, it means here on the top, on the bottom, I like it on the bottom. I can change the font of the level one and now it goes. Um, prints, if I don't want the prints in here, visible, I will just change it to false and it will not be shown. I can also decide what um, on the prints, what fields will be shown, you see false and uh, I just need trade, size and time. I don't need the ECN also. I can show you ask and bid and uh, whatever I want. I need uh, to put them. Um, what else in here? Nothing. Show labels. Um, sh show uh, symbol inside button. It will show you the EAT inside. If I take it off, you'll see it just sell, short, buy. Eh, just nice. It doesn't mean it doesn't mean anything. And that's basically it. You can change the colors here or whatever you want. This is the settings of the level 2. Anything else here? Yeah, click entry is a third. If you want to see, you change the back one, change the color, stock list. It's not, uh, it just linked to to what I already put in here. If I will put another stock like cut in this one and I'll click here and the stock list cut will now be on V because this is like the last couple of names that I used. Okay, so I messed this up a, li a little bit, but let's uh, see how uh, I basically put on a trade. Okay, so just a second, I will uh, reload uh, my uh, my setup. This is my full screen and uh, 
our trade. So what we'll basically do now is uh, take like a test trade. What you want to trade? Something we need something that is moving. Let's do CHRW. Okay, so as I said uh, earlier, on settings I will show you um, the alt keys that I have. Okay, so what I have, I have uh, four alt keys. Um, I have edge a buy, that means a limit buy on control A. Edge a sell, that's a limit sell on control S. I have stop market buy and stop market sell. That's basically the four I use uh, to enter into positions. I have also uh, on the keyboard here, I have some more stuff like uh, cancels and on preferences. This is like delete, it's delete all, all orders. I have the, sorry, I have the, on the, on the rows on the keyboard to increase my size or to, in, to increase the price. And um, that's basically it, I don't use most of the stuff as you can see. So let's say I want to short um, CHRW just below um, 5820. So I will just click um, Control Q. I will enter the price 5119. Tab will switch here to the size. We'll put the size, let's say it's 500. Oh, short, sorry. So it's Control W, almost made a mistake. 500. I click Enter and the order is in. Okay, I can cancel the order in here. I can uh, right click it or do an order update. So now prices went up. So I have 500 stop prices here. I'll change the price, let's say to 29. And I will click sell. This one put on position, this one on orders. So you can see the order is just in here on the bottom. And the order is just waiting to get filled below 58.30 now. This is 58.29 is uh, the order I've put in. It's not in yet. The cancel, as you can see, is here, but um, basically I can move it just because it's on the demo. I can go to settings, select columns, okay, and move the cancel it's better to move it here okay to the beginning so uh, basically if I want to cancel this order I will have this at uh, the left side of the screen let's go to another uh, stocks meanwhile to Facebook let's try and short Facebook so I'll do it on a uh, limit now what I'll do is control S I have sell just uh, with the arrows I uh, put up the price a little bit here's my order on CHRW got in, you can see I have uh, minus 500 short at 28 that's the price that I got okay and I will increase my size I can just write it down now with the arrows just taking, uh, taking it up or down and I just click okay this one sound is choppy okay sorry for that and uh, let's switch back to CHRW. I can click on this one so it will switch back. So now, let's say I want to cover, I can or cover, like, let's say 25% on the right click. So it will send an order, you see it covered 100. Um, I can cover by a stop market order. I can do 58, 41. On, um, just bring in my size, it will be 400. I click enter. Okay, so I have it here, the order, just waiting in here um, to get stopped out on 58.41. If it will get there, I can uh, CHRW, can go here, buy now 100 on 34, click, okay, so it got executed. I have only 300, so I go to here, I do an order update and I have this window here of the other update so I, I have now only s oh sorry I have only let's cancel this I have only 300 so I need to update the order ah now I don't have order because I cancel it okay so I'll just cover now so I can click 
tab it will be I'm now long doesn't matter it was long because I was 400 okay on the stop and I was only 300 uh, short so I can now sell CHRW on market from this button and that's it I can also go like 500 um, 500 buy okay in here and then I'll go here click this one and do flatten all and it will close everything by itself it doesn't need me to just sell on market so this is like a test trade okay so I think we got over almost everything um, I'd like to hear some questions uh, from you guys uh, just start typing if someone have question and I will go uh, over it okay okay let's go back just to the slideshow for a minute we didn't talk about pricing of uh, Fusion Fusion can start on a trainee account you can start free maximum daily loss is $150 position share limit is uh, 7500 until you reach 500 net which means that after you reach a 500 net you are going to a poor account poor account is $90 um, the fee comes with a data Nasdaq level 1 NYC level 1 but in edge this is what I'm trading at there is you can add more level 2 uh, routes by adding more $82 I'm trading with the $90 and I don't really need more routes um, that's it to discuss commission and everything just contact me or Ann on Skype uh, on info this is uh, the phone me in Israel 972-549-9844-73021 let's go get back to the chart and see what you ask um, save the layout Save the layout you can do um, from the settings window. You just bring up the settings window. Here you have a layout and you save layout to file. You click here and you just save it with wherever you want on your uh, machine. Or when you just uh, cancel everything and click to get out, um, just click to get out. Then it asks you if you want to save it or not and then you can uh, save it uh, Jacob Rick I have six charts on one monitor but they always are out of line when I reopen I don't have that problem I have on the other screen that I'm using I have uh, 12 charts and they're always the same you just need to you just need to uh, save it I think Rick okay Danny how come your Facebook is out to bow on your platform yeah yeah was there was no problem on uh, Danny on uh, on shorting uh, Facebook uh, this morning on the real platform nothing this is a demo through our clearing firm everything is just I mean everything just shortable I don't see any H for uh, on out to bow for days you uh, how did you get a time and sell next to the level 2 okay so when you right click here and you go to settings okay I show this you have prints here you need to go over the fields and visible to true if you want them um, do you have Arca in the trainee account in the trainee account you can trade on Arca you don't see it here on the level 2 you don't see Arca on the level 2 you can trade with Arca of course can I import settings from DAS? no Jacob DAS is one platform um, this is totally different platform you can't uh, you can't import settings from one platform to another because they don't they don't know how to talk to each other um, you see most of the routes as Ran said you can't take uh, shares uh, um, of 50 or 20 
I didn't try all the routes, I must tell you. Um, they said the Cleveland films that some routes can, but I didn't try them all. The one, I don't, it, for me, it doesn't bother so much to take just 100, but if it's bother you too much, uh, so uh, you just trade on DAS, that's it. Can I import text file list of shares? Um, I don't do it, but there is load stock list, so I guess you can do it. This is called an SDK file, so it's only if you save them here on the platform, I guess, and then you can load them from here. ננסה להבין מה אתה אומר. Let's position button. There is a... Let's say I, I will take Microsoft. Okay. And I will trade like a 1,000 share. I will buy Microsoft. Okay, so now I'm in 1,000. Okay, I mean, so um, I switch to um, Qs and then get back to Microsoft. I have a button, tap button, boom. This is position size. Okay, I have a button on the keyboard that uh, do it. Um, the entire layout. You mean the carbon layout? I will need to bring this uh, this one here. Okay, you have style, and then you change the layout colors here. בסקיים 600 מניות, כאשר אני עובר למניה אחרת, כמות המניות היא דיפולט של 500, איך אני מחזיר את כמות המניות כאשר אני בעסקה? אוקיי, okay, so, uh, הנה, כמו שהראיתי לו, לא, יוסי, תראה, אם אני עכשיו נמצא במייקרוסופט ב-1000, ואני עובר נגיד לאפל, אוקיי, okay, ואני חוזר למייקרוסופט, אני יש לי כמות של טאב, אז היא פשוט מביאה לי, הטאב תמיד יביא לי את הכמות המניות של הפוזישן שיש לי כרגע. זה פשוט עוד קי שאני עשיתי בקיבורד. שמביא את, ה... את הכמות שאתה כרגע נמצא. Pay attention to this green line, you can see this is the price that we are in, okay? 2804, this is the price of, uh, of the deal, I'm a buyer on this side here, so this is green. If I'll be in, a, if I'll take a city group and I will take short, 200, okay, so it will be a red line that will show where I am at in on short. So when I get back to Microsoft, it gives me this. I like to see, it gives me this. I click on tab, it gives me 200. Can you show how to set up odd keys again? Yeah, I can show how to set up odd keys again. איך אתה מעדכן את הכפתור? אני אראה לך כפתורים חמים שוב פעם. Odd keys are here from settings, you go to trade, trader keys, okay, you got the setting window, windows again, so let's say I want to do a um, stop market like I have, okay, so this is how the stop market uh, has been set uh, in here, okay, I stop market buy, stop market buy, um, I did a control Q, the destination is called stop market, okay. Side is buy, type is stock market. I can also do it, let's say, okay. no, no. there are some other routes that have stops that I can use. I just use this one. I don't remember from where it goes through, but I can look on my trade reporting to tell you. And uh, that's it. What I have also here, I can use the lot. I mean, I can set that this will always... Uh, be the size that will go up in the box or not. 
I don't use it, I don't want to be any size of this box. Okay. Um, I can bid or ask, it means what price will be on the box when I uh, when I set uh, the add keys. If I click none, then it will be on zero. So if I'm buying, I want it to be on the ask. If I short, I want it to be on the on the bid. It doesn't really matter. It just need to be at the price that is really close to the price right now. Um, box, it will mean it will open this box. This is important. Um, for example, I forgot about this one. This one, it means it will go into the box. Okay, I can do. Um, it means that if I click like uh, the limit here, it will go here and will show me the box and I can change the price and I can change the the size or whatever. If I don't use it, okay, if I don't use it, it will just uh, go without the box and it will just uh, execute uh, the order automatically. So I prefer to uh, do it with the box and to, uh, to authorize every position that I'm at. The position key is here on keyboard. You switch from trader keys to uh, keyboard. I think it's here. Let me just see. Here it is. Get position size. So you click tab and you have it. Order ex execution. That means I have I have number one is enter and the order execution number two is num enter. That's really uh, nice to use the num enter. This is the enter near the numbers because when you enter the size in the numbers and uh, you just update it with the arrows and then you just hit a click on the number enter and then you got uh, the orders uh, flying into the system so it's nice. Here is where I set up all the control and it selects in the stock sorter. The stock sorter is the lists. Okay, it's called the uh, stock sorter. So control N will select all, control V will delete it. That's it, we have uh, positions now. That we can close. Go to Microsoft, I have 800, so, and this is long. I will go here, I'll do 500. I will go a little bit here, 28, A9. I can just trail with the uh, with the price, I click num enter, it's in, it sells Swedja, executed, executed, executed. Here it is, I have open PLL of 50, closed PNL of 47.50, still have 500. I'll sell them now again. A 10, use my order, a 10, I can cancel the order, you saw the order in here. If the order is sitting, let's say I have Citigroup, so we have short at 70, 37.44. Okay, so let's do a stop order at 37.61. 200 is the shares that we have. Submit. Okay, so I have the order here, but it do doesn't show. What I wanted to show you is that I will do another update. So let's do it 37.49 by what I wanted to show you is the orders that they are basically in here, you can just cancel them from here. You saw that for example, they have a box in X, I don't know why now it doesn't show up. Doesn't matter. Do it here, cover 75, cover 100, that's it. You're flat, you don't have any more position. Just cover on the right click and that's it. You can do it also with a NAT key to cover and to enter into this in, in and f out from strategy. You don't have to use the right click but this is uh, really comfortable to do with the mouse. Okay so uh, this is Fusion. As I said uh, account opening process is really easy. Um, just contact me or uh, yeah it's market of course. It's, it's not market of course. This is uh, remember the cover strategy that we set here on the defaults. So we decided that cover strategy will be market for Marca, but you can decide whatever you uh, you want. Okay, um, if you guys want I can do a DAS in a couple of weeks as well. We have it also on uh, YouTube, but that's in Ibu. Account opening process is 
really easy, um, really easy and fast. Um, we have uh, really good commissions. If you are a struggling trader, then you can start free on Fusion, and that will be a really, really uh, good price. No, it's not through BSI. If you're trading with BSI, um, just contact me, and I'll explain you all your opportunities. בעצם מי שסוחר דרך ביסאי, צור איתי קשר, דבר איתי ואני אסביר לך את האפשרויות שלך. If you trade in uh, with Nevis and you're on DAS or other platforms, you can uh, switch easily. Yeah, only with Nevis is a uh, minimum deposit is to 2500 and uh, buying power is 1 to 20. As I said, you have all the routes, full rebates um, you can get um, what else um, as I said it's free at the beginning after that it's ninety dollar a month only and there's a software rebates if you do a uh, volume if you do volume uh, we do software re software rebates so basically you have a great deal you have all of our support we do one on one uh, everyone who's opening an account and need to be set set up and everything we do one-on-one -on -one, uh, setting up will help you on your computer to set up the account and everything uh, you have all of our support Mioran whenever uh, you need one um, 100% uh, payout yeah it's not a uh, prop and uh, that's it hope you enjoyed if you don't have any questions on uh, Fusion um, so thanks every, thank you very much to everyone. Uh, we have in a, a next webinar will be on gaps next week. We have a seminar on uh, 11th. Um, if you are not here in the room and you want to join for a free two weeks, just uh, let us know by the email or uh, to me and uh, run. Night bowing power is one to two. So um, just let us know, 14 days free trial. וזהו, תודה לכולם. אם יש לכם עוד שאלות, אני פה ואני אשמח לענות. Uh, מוזמנים להצטרף לחדר שלנו. האם יש לנו זה info at g6trading.com. מי שרוצה לשמוע על פתיחת חשבון או שיש לו יותר שאלות, אז uh, מוזמן לדבר איתנו. הטלפון שלי זה גם בארץ, 054-998-4473. הנה יוסי מנסה אותה כבר שבוע והיא מאוד מבסוט וזהו מי שרוצה להצטרף לחדר שבועיים ניסיון כמו שאמרתי חופשי אתם מוזמנים רק לשלוח לנו אימייל וזהו אני חושב שהתנאים הם באמת תנאים מצוינים התמיכה שאני חושב שהיא לפעמים הרבה יותר חשובה לטריידר מאשר, מאשר כל דבר אחר היא הכי טובה שתוכלו לקבל בכל מקום וזהו, תודה לכולם, ויש לנו הודעת ריבית עוד מעט. אז תהנו.